Belen had the opportunity to host a night with Eva Moses Kor, a Holocaust survivor. She was born 1934 in the Christian village of Potts, Romania. There she lived the farm life with three other siblings. She and her sister Miriam were twins and would be the only ones who'd live to see liberation from concentration camp. She was only six years old when the SS soldiers occupied the village, and two years later, she and her family would be transferred to Auschwitz. The last, the third day of the trip, we asked for water and the answer came back in German. I instantly understood what happened, and so did everybody else in our counter car. We have been lied to, we were not going to Hungary to a labor camp, but we are being taken to Germany to be murdered. As a twin, she was put under many cruel experiments as a victim of Nazi doctor Joseph Mengele. The one little detail that's important. If one twin died as a result of the experiment that he was trying to perform, then the other twin was killed. And those twin who died in the experiment did not die in the barrack. Those who happened to die in the barrack were dying because of the conditions in the camp, starvation or some disease that they were not in. When she came to speak at the Roca Theater, I got a chance to speak with her in private about her story of forgiveness and how she overcame the fears of her past. Forgiveness, in my opinion, and I struggle with that a great deal because people do not understand my forgiveness. Number one, it does not absolve the perpetrator from their crimes. My forgiveness has everything to do with Eva Kaur, and the world is always concerned. Can we punish the perpetrators and then the victims will feel good? She serves an amazing example, especially now that Pope Francis declared this year the year of mercy. For WBLN, 